What is going on, I have Warriors? It's your boy Edward V, and today we're going to talk about what's the perfect cardio for you to do when it comes to intermittent fasting. Coming up. So what's going on, I have Warriors? In this video, I'm going to break down what's the uh, cardio that I choose to do and what's the best cardio to do for intermittent fasting. I used to do HIIT cardio, H-I-I-T, which I still kind of do and I'm going to explain to you in a bit. HIIT cardio while running is okay, is good, but there's a stationary element to it and it isn't as dynamic in terms of elevating your heart rate to burn more body fat or to burn more calories and of course if you're fasted you're going to burn more body fat from that to those calories but it's not as dynamic and it, it started to become very very stale after a while i, I kind of dreaded even running because i was so bored of the action of just running you know for 30 minutes so what i do now of course as you know is i jump rope this is really really underestimated in terms of how effective it is to burn fat with jumping rope you could actually burn up to 10 calories per minute uh jumping rope uh, since you're moving your arms and you're hopping in place that exerts a lot of energy and it increases your heart rate when you get a speed rope you can up that to almost 15 calories per minute and this is a speed rope i've been jumping rope way before i came out with my own product i was just so you know like bored of running and this is pretty exciting you can you know you get better at it as you keep doing it you keep getting better at it and you actually start to learn little tricks here and there when you do jump rope one thing about jump rope that makes it really good for intermittent fasting is that that hopping and that movement of your hands and the fact that you can speed up if you want to all of that dynamicness of jumping rope you know the crisscrossing of your feet uh you know the crisscrossing of your arms that dynamicness actually elevates your heart rate much better than if you're running which is just one motion and all of that if you're doing it in a fastest state all of that is activating more fat cells to come out of your body via the calorie uh secretion for for the energy that you're using one thing that i will explain is that i did use one very popular jump rope when i was first starting out but the handles the handles that are out there and this is the reason why I, I, it clicked in my brain to make a jump rope. Because one, I wanted a good jump rope for myself. And uh, two, it was just, they were literally break. The cable was not gel infused. It was like cable-ish. It was like that cable, black cable kind of thing. And it would hit the pavement and it would just rip. And then like the inside of the, of the rope would be shown. So like, I made sure I made mine durable, gel infused. And then the handles were almost all plastic. Almost all of them were plastic. Mine's are, mine's is aluminum with the grip, but they were almost all plastic. So like if I dropped it or if I stepped on it by accident or, you know, they didn't even stay on my hands comfortably. Like they would kind of slide a little bit too. So this, I made sure to have the grip and make it aluminum. So it's extremely durable. One thing that they all did that I knew that I wanted my jump rope to do as well is adjust. So this way it could adjust to anyone's height. I don't like cutting this, but you can cut it. And with my jump rope, this kind of this black thing right here it comes off so you can cut it at any size and then you can put this black thing right back on it and then this will basically allow you know for for any size and then at the end of it it'll still look really really sharp really really clean because you got that on there i switched to jumping rope because it's fun it's fun to do and you can burn up to you know 15 calories per minute 10 calories on a normal rope 15 calories on a speed rope and this is a 90 degree rope so it's sideways like this and then you can see like this spins right here as a swivel and this swivel is what makes it go fast you know makes it go faster than than normal if it didn't have the swivel and it wasn't 90 degrees 
and I'm gonna show you how to do the exercise even if you never jump rope before. This is what I do. Don't think about how many jumps you're doing. Don't think about that. And I know it's hard for people who haven't really done jump rope to understand or, or do any type of jump rope exercise, but simply put a timer. Simply put a timer on your phone. This is my workout. I do a five minute warm up before I even start lifting weights. And then I do, I do a 20 minute jump and I'll put this on the floor facing up or you know, on the wall on the floor looking towards me or anywhere where I can see it. And then I'll just start jumping, start jumping, jumping. I'll speed up sometimes. I create my own hit within that, that exercise. So I'm just jumping, 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 jumping. And then I'll be like, oh, you know what? Let me speed it up right now. So I'll do speed, 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 speed. And then I'll see it for like 30 seconds. Then I'll stop. Then I'll just keep jumping, keep jumping. And the, just the act of jumping will build your dexterity and you'll be better at jumping rope when you build your dexterity from just doing it, just actually going out and, and, and jumping rope you know, it'll build your dexterity little by little. So don't feel in fear of jumping rope simply because you've never done it before. It'll come to you. My wife, she was not good at all in the beginning. She was okay. She was not good at all, but she, she started to get it. And now she could do it, you know, without messing up for a long time. So even if you're jumping and you mess up, just get right back on it. Keep jumping, keep jumping, keep jumping. Don't worry if you mess up, just worry about the time. Keep going as much as you can, do as much as you can until the time ends. And then once that happens, you're all set. You'll see how much sweat you, you is coming out of your body. It's actually more sweat came out of my body from jumping rope than when I was running. I did my transformation. I did the jump rope. I did it exclusively. I didn't do anything else running or anything like that for my one month and a half transformation. It was simply jumping rope. Jumping rope also, is twofold because it'll build your legs, it'll build your calves, it'll build your bottom, your behind. It also builds your shoulders and your arms from the rotation. And another thing is you're investing for your future body because it's lower impact than running. Running is a hard impact uh, and that messes you up your joints in the long run. You might have bad knees or you know what have you. But with jump rope, since you're just skipping a few inches off the ground it's much better for you in terms of impact because it's a lower impact if you're gonna do jump rope this is the best jump rope you can choose i kid you not it was literally completely designed based off of my experience with jumping rope with a plastic jump rope that was very popular it was a very popular one and i realized that there, the market needed something better that can last long because if you're gonna do something like this, you wanna do it for a long time. You don't wanna just put it to the side and use it once in a while. This is something you use every time you work out. And I did this four times a week. So work out four days a week, I did cardio four days a week. And I did it this exact way, just how I explained it to you. And if you buy the Fledge Fitness Jump Rope, it does come with the Fledge Fitness carrying case. So you can put this inside this case you can put this case in your bag. You don't really want to have a jump rope without a case because then it's like your, the, the rope is all over the place. Here, you just wrap the rope up, boom, throw it in here, close this up, you know what I'm saying? And then you have this in a nice tidy place that you can find that you can grab. So there you have it, guys. That is the best cardio in terms of entertainment because cardio is boring guys come on let's be real <laughs> so at least you want to do something that feels fun and feels different you know you could do different little moves with your feet you could do different little steps and it, it, as you get better and it's much more it's easier to do in that fashion um running gets really old really really fast so this is why I switched and this is why I feel like you guys should switch if you still do running. Plus you can control your own hit uh, by looking at the timer and deciding if how fast you wanna go for 30 seconds, if you wanna go faster for one minute, and it's really up to you. But I still priced it at $16.50, $16.50 because I want you guys to be able to buy the jump rope. It's, it's really like my profit is not as much 
as probably someone else who made a you know a plastic one that's like around the price that I have mine and you know and they're selling it for that amount mine's is literally the profit is much much smaller just because I want to make you guys be able to have this product and make it easy for you guys to buy the product and yes of course the ultimate goal is to do this forever do this type of thing do content for you you know give you good you know nice gear that you can use that'll help you that'll actually help you not like a like a workout program or anything like that and that's the goal to be able to do this for a living so I can bring more content to you so you can go ahead and buy that jump rope right here on this card and it'll take you to my website and from my website if you wait a little bit the photo will come up and it'll say get the jump rope you can click that button or if you just scroll down you'll see the Amazon sign because it's being sold through Amazon uh, in partnership with Amazon and then you can go ahead and click that and it'll take you right to the jump rope and a lot of you guys have bought the jump rope already go ahead and leave a review on Amazon of how you enjoy the jump rope give an honest review I really would appreciate it if you can just go up onto uh, amazon.com and review it uh, that will help me a lot honest review I would love the feedback. And that is it. I hope this has helped you for the cardio aspect. If you have any other questions to any other videos that I've had in the past, I'll have one here. My subscribe button will be right there. And if you haven't bought the jump rope from the card that I put up, you can go ahead and buy it right here. I'll take it to my website. And from my website, you just click over and you will get to the jump rope. Have a good one, guys. I'll see you on Wednesday. Peace.